frustrated parents unite on my kids ruin something, dating for ugly people, and fighting identity theft with location services. I'm Pilpita. You're watching Wet B TV. Location-based services seem to be all the trend these days, with popular check-in apps like Foursquare, Gowalla, and Facebook Places. But a new product shows these services can also help fight identity theft. It's called Pinpoint and is developed by location provider Location Labs and fraud detection service FinSphere. Here's how it works. When you're using your credit card, Pinpoint tracks the location and then matches it to the location of your cell phone. If your credit card and your cell phone are far apart, you'll get an alert. And if it's serious, you can call their fraud hotline. This is very helpful if you don't analyze every transaction that is taking place on your account. If there's a strange transaction from the other side of the world, for example, Pinpoint will alert you. Plus point accounts are free for one credit card and one cell phone. Not so plus point, it's only available in the US for now. Well, services that are available anywhere, anytime, and for everyone, dating sites. There are services for vegetarians, geeks, dog lovers, and even one for just beautiful people, where only so-called attractive people can join. Well, now there's options for the other side of the spectrum, the plain-looking, regular Joes that don't always like what they see in the mirror, or as a new dating site calls it, ugly schmugs. Check this out. Ugly Schmucks is a new dating site for people that don't look like overly perfect movie stars. On this site, there's no need for Photoshop or modify profile pictures. In fact, too much prettiness is frowned upon. There's even an Ugly Schmuck rating system where members can vote out overly attractive people. How about that? The concept actually isn't new. The Ugly Bug Ball in the UK has been hooking up aesthetically challenged people for a while. They say their service works because instead of fishing in a small pool of prettiness and getting nowhere, members dive into an ocean of uglies and have more choice. Up to the ugly bug ball. And a happy time we'll have there. One and all at, at the, the ugly bug ball. ball. Viewer Omar Chin shared an interesting website with me about some friends who are traveling the US by foot. That's right, these guys are walking from New York to Los Angeles and have already been walking for six months. Along the 3,000 mile walk, the young filmmakers do interviews with locals. Their Facebook page is constantly updated and shows that the team supposedly reached California this week. Very cool. Well, while these youngsters have the adventure of their lives, many parents experience different types of adventures that are a little less joyful. Esther, what happened, baby? What happened? What happened? Do it. <laughs> well, at least it seems like she could laugh about it. We all know kids can ruin the craziest things. The website of the day highlights all that mess from peeled down walls and ruined Kindles to painted cats. Anything that was destroyed, made filthy, or otherwise ruined because a kid touched it. My Kids Ruined is a hilarious site for parents to share a maybe painful laugh. And for non-parents, perfect birth control. Just kidding. You know I love kids. Especially when they're covered in red stuff that's also all over the floor. Oh well, I can't say that I never did anything stupid. I remember washing our phone and television with lots of hot water and soap. They had never been so clean. And I had no idea why my parents were so upset. All right, enough nonsense. Thanks for watching, everyone. Keep those comments coming on webbeat.tv and tweet me at Pulpina. Have a great weekend. Try not to ruin anything. Bye. It is on. <clears throat> it is? Uh-huh. Oh, dear God. Pulpina Webbeat, take one. Okay, Pulpina, one, two, three. I'll do it tonight. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. I'll get my headset on before because I don't want to do it.